Congrats on becoming the proud owner of Limerick's Joy, the FDA's highest safety rated hospital grade breast pump and the only one with a compression and vacuum action that simulates your baby's natural nursing pattern. Before you get started, make sure to clean anything that will come in contact with your milk. Make sure to wash your hands thoroughly with soap and water before handling the newly sanitized parts. Everything else can be wiped down with a good antibacterial detergent. No need to sanitize the filter and tubing since it doesn't come in contact with your milk. Okay, let's begin. Press down on the cycle speed button to turn on your pump. You'll hear a muted flutter sound. Now, hold the breast cups together. Initially, the cups will pulsate, then collapse and inflate as you increase the vacuum. Remember, always press the cups together before use just to be sure everything's working fine. Okay, just shut off the pump and you're ready to begin. Place the cups on your breasts, making sure to center your nipples in the tunnel of each cup. Then slide your arm under the tubing, supporting one cup with your forearm and the other with your hand. Now you've got one hand free to turn on the pump. Push down on the cycle speed knob to turn it on. You should begin to feel a very gentle, flutter-like sensation, similar to that of your baby nursing. The cycle speed knob also simulates the rhythm of your baby's sucking pattern. Its default and most comfortable setting is 30. It's best to leave it there until you settle on your preferred vacuum setting, which may take you a few sessions to establish. If, after several uses, the cycle still feels too fast, just turn it down in small increments, as little movements can make a big difference. The goal is to match your baby's natural pattern. The vacuum strength knob controls the strength of both the suction and compression. For this knob, the lower the number, the weaker the suction, with one being the lowest and 80 being the highest. When the pump first starts, you'll feel a flutter-like sensation. The pump's most comfortable setting, meant to mimic your baby's flutter suck, which stimulates your letdown reflex. That's when the milk starts to flow from your breast. It may start with a few drops before you see a flow, and it may take a minute or two before you see milk. It's always better to wait a couple of minutes before increasing the level. But remember, just like with the cycle speed knob, when you do, it should always be in small increments. Most new moms prefer it between 14 and 35. Bottom line, it should be comfortable for you. So just adjust the knob slowly to what feels right. The digital display shows the number you chose for your cycle speed and vacuum strength. The cycle speed rarely changes since it's for fine tuning. You can, however, save the vacuum strength and cycle speed setting that works best for you. Just push the vacuum strength knob in for three to five seconds until you see saved preset on screen. Release the knob and you're all set. The next time you go to pump, just push the vacuum strength knob in and release. The screen will display the loading preset and the pump will slowly adjust to your favorite setting. The timer lets you know how many minutes you've been pumping. Once you've adjusted everything to your satisfaction, the recommended pump time is about 15 to 20 minutes. When you're finished, it's usually best to turn the pump off first that prevents the milk from backflowing into the tubing and filter. Then, leaning forward, remove your breast cups and place them in the bottle holders. Now, disconnect the tubes and let them hang loose. You might see some condensation in the tubing. That's usually caused by a difference between your body's and the room's temperature. To dry out the tubes, just use your pump's drying mode. Turn the pump back on, then press down on the same knob for about three to five seconds until you see drying mode appear on the display. When it does, release the knob and follow the on-screen directions. Questions? We're here for you.